today we are going to do some crevicing for some gemstones. It's a little bit different to what we're usually out doing on the weekends, but hey, I have been getting quite enthusiastic about gemstones lately, so today we're going to put in a little bit of time and effort and see what we can come up with. So let's hit it, eh? And what I'm looking for is some exposing bedrock like such and we are just going to hone in on some gravel deposits. Ideally, we would like to be out in amongst here, but the water flow is just a bit too uh, full on at the moment. So we're just gonna make do with what we can and try our luck with some of these gravels. We'll just sort of play it by ear and see how we go. couple of little gems in there, zircon, could be a ruby, highly doubt it though. Very nice, let's get this red one out. Most likely a zircon. Out it's a ruby, but very nice. Put these two in the snuffer bottle with the other gems I have gathered up early this morning. We'll show you a look at those at the end of the video. Only if you subscribe. It's a deal. Ideally, I might. There's some nice gravels in amongst there. I might um, start scooping those out. Might even get the bait pump inside there and just see what we can get out of it. So, wish me luck. Okay, we got our a nice juicy sapphire, a zircon or ruby. I don't think it's ruby, but a spinel. But yeah, check this bad boy out. That is a sapphire, believe it or not, it is just really dark. We'll add it to our collection. Yeah, Sancho, he is just upstream a little bit. And when he comes back down, I will show him a look at the stones I've gotten. That is probably the biggest sapphire I have ever found. And when I get home, I'll get a torch onto it, actually. Oh, I've got the Olight Warrior Mini 2. So let's uh, turn this on, we'll sit that sapphire on it and see how transparent it is. There we go. 
go. Not too shabby. All right, let's knuckle down, get some material processed, and we'll see how we go with it, eh? to turn the phone off for about half an hour to let it cool down a little bit but we have been working a crevice and we got some really good stones out of this one just below the surface here there is a crevice that goes down quite a ways and I've just been sort of bait pumping in and around this crevice punching down as far as I can possibly go and the bonus about doing that is I actually started getting some half respectable gold at the bottom as well as uh, sapphires and zircons and that. So let's continue on. I'll do maybe one more uh, clean out of this crevice. We will actually pan that out and just see what sort of results we can get out of our very last pans worth of material. Pan this bad girl out. See if we got anything. See, my sieve is a little bit too large to catch these finer stones. Not that they're worth much, but they are cool to look at. We'll just pan this out a little bit slower than we would if we were panning gold. We'll work our way down till we start seeing some colour stones and then na 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 boo boo. Ugh, have we got any colour in this? We got a zircon, that's a bonus. See, we've got a few coloured stones. I will empty the snuffer bottle and show you as a look at all the good stuff we did get today. But we've got a speck of gold there, speck of gold there, and a speck of gold just there. So, what I'll do is I'll add those into the snuffer bottle, and then we'll do a little bit of a snuffer bottle dump and show you a look at all the gold and the coloured stones we actually did find today. There you go. Some nice sapphires. I've got a really big one in here somewhere, if I can find it, right there. That is a sapphire. Just really dark. And hard to see through. But you've got to trust me on it. Um, but yeah, we've got a lot of zircons and some nice sapphires. That's a nice one though. That is a really nice big one. But yeah, not too shabby. Oh, and we can't forget the gold. I'll clean it all up once I'm back at home and I've got two hands on it, but I think that's a bit of melted aluminium, but we've got a speck of gold next to it. 
a, few, a little picker and some finer gold in amongst here. But I will uh, probably get all that back into the snuffer bottle. Once I am back at home, I will have all this cleaned up for you. We'll get a nice up close picture of all this stuff in the pan at the very end. And with all that being said, I may as well probably sign off from here. Love yous and leave yous. And I will see yous in the next video. Peace.